In this problem, we've got a triangle, and instead of degree measures for uh, a couple of the angles, they've given us these algebra expressions. And uh, what they're asking us to do is to find what the actual degree measures are for each of these. This shouldn't be too tough. The central concept here is that the angles, the three angles of a triangle, add up to 180. So we're going to set up an equation where we add all the angles together and set it equal to 180. This one right here is given to us already. That little box means that this is a 90 degree angle. So if I wanted to set up an equation where I added all the angles together, I could say 90 plus 5x plus 2 plus 2x plus 32 equals 180 degrees. So there's our equation. We can solve that for x. And then we want to find the, the angle measures of each of these angles, so we'll have to plug x back into these expressions. So let's do a little simplification here. Let's see, 90 plus 2 plus 32 is 124, and 5x plus 2x. So this is 7x plus 124 equals 180. So I can subtract 124 to get the x term alone. And let's see, that's going to give me 50, oops, 124, 56 over here, and 7x over here, divide by 7. And we get x equals 8. Now let's uh, plug them back in. So if we put it in 8 here, we'd get 16 plus 32. That would be 48 degrees for h. And if we put in 8 for x here, 5 times 8 is 40, plus 2 is 42 degrees, and we already had our 90 degrees there. So that's how to find the angle measures in a triangle uh, where they're giving algebraic expressions for some of the angles.